Hello beer fans, Hero Brewing Company here. Welcome to my beer library, where I do beer reviews, a beer vlog, and I also make beer. So look for those videos. Um, today we're gonna be trying a holiday tradition every single year for the last, I wanna say about seven years, I have gotten the Great Lakes Brewing Company Christmas Ale uh, around Christmas time, which it is right now. Uh, this sells out, so it is a limited edition thing, so make sure you go and get it while you can. If you cannot, it will be gone. Um, it is very delicious, and we are going to do a video about it tonight because a lot of people that are not from Ohio have not heard of it, which is crazy because this is God's greatest invention to us. So basically it says uh, Great Lakes Brewing Company Christmas Ale, a Yuletide worthy of holiday spices and sweet honey, honey to keep your wazzling, to keep you a wazzling all season long. And then, unwrap our label artwork to discover a wreath surrounding a candle, a symbol of unity and light and make your own spirit brighter uh, so it looks like you can pull off this to make something cleveland ohio okay let's read the bottle all right actually sorry let's read the bottle let's get through this do not open till christmas it's the 18th Whoever coined that phrase obviously hasn't tasted Christmas ales, fresh honey, cinnamon, and ginger flavors. Brewed and bottled by Great Glakes Brewing Company, Cleveland, Ohio. Freshest if by, like two months from now. So we we're trying this. Uh, 1988, uh, Cleveland, Ohio, Great Lakes Brewing Company, Christmas ale, 30 IBU, 7.5% out of my volume. You got the... Uh, it's like a wagon type of, or Christmas a train with little Christmas balls in it. Same thing that's on the box there. In the lid is the same lid that they have for their the majority of their stuff. So I was expecting this to be pretty dark, but kind of also brown. And we're going to put this in the Christmas Ale category. So I don't know if we've done anything like that before. So we are now. There you go. It smells like spiced beer is what it smells like. So it's clear. It's red. It's kind of like a, a reddish brown. Spice, or spiced beer is what it smells like to me. I'm not gonna lie. It's really good. Now, Great Lakes, one of my favorite brewers, um, they have a lot of different blends that they put out every single year. And I think that's a really good idea. It's good marketing, first of all. But I think it's also a good idea because um, like people keep coming back to it like me. Every single December, starting December 1st, I start looking for this. If you can't get this by December 15th, don't plan on getting it because it'll be sold out. And I don't even know how it is outside of Ohio. But if you can't find this by December 15th in Ohio, it's sold out already. So you really have to get into it. Um... It tastes like honey beer, but with some cinnamon added to it. So kind of like a, I don't know if you guys are coffee fans, but kind of like a, uh, like a cinnamon, a cinnamon latte um, is what it kind of tastes like, um, but with beer added to it. Really good, delicious. You could drink all six of these in one night and be just fine. Um, now I will say, uh, against them 
it's a little bit pricey, okay? Uh, because it is a seasonal thing, so it does go fast, but it is a little bit pricey. Probably about, um, depending on where you live, I think this costs about 10 bucks for a six pack for me. Um, if you live maybe outside of Ohio, probably a little bit more, maybe $12.99 for a six pack or something, maybe higher. I don't know. But um, delicious holiday tradition, and we will keep doing it over and over again. Let's go ahead and grade it. So we're gonna put this in the Christmas beer category, the Christmas ale category. Um, okay, 100 being the best, zero being the worst. Um, I'm gonna place you at an 86. And the reason why so low is because when you think of Christmas, you think of like gingerbread, you know, candy cane, stuff like that. You don't get any of those Christmas flavors in this beer. You get cinnamon and honey and beer, which is perfectly fine. But if I'm gonna call it a Christmas beer, I would want the typical Christmas flavors. Now, like I said, every single Christmas I've gotten this for the last seven, eight years in a row. Um, and love it. Absolutely love it. I at least get a six pack. I have a buddy who lives in Tennessee who drives all the way to Ohio and gets cases of this to take back to Tennessee. Uh, so that's saying something for this uh, company and everything else. So if you never had the Christmas ale from Great Lakes, good luck finding it, maybe next year. Um, but it is wonderful, it is delicious, and um, you should definitely make this part of your Christmas tradition. All right? Subscribe, like, comment, share, watch the rest of our videos. Cheers. Try something you never had before and make a new tradition. Cheers.